Lil TJ recently called out Aiden Ross for what he sees as cultural appropriation, accusing him of being a culture vulture for exploiting Kodak Black's influence to gain popularity. I told Aiden a culture vulture, he told me I'm on perks. I don't take perks. I don't take drugs. I might sip lane a little now and then. <laughs> Actually less than you. Fucking racist nigga. I look like I take perks because I'm black, right? I know. I know. He told me, I sent him a voice note about how I feel like your culture vulture. He told me he's not watching that. He's watching the election. And that I need to stop taking perks. That's what he think about niggas. He just grind his way to the top using that little face call he got. And use niggas. That niggas better stay woke. Niggas use everybody. They only fuck with the top notch niggas because they using niggas. Culture vulture. TJ's criticism goes beyond Ross's relationship with Kodak, digging into a deeper issue of exploitation within the entertainment industry, particularly when it comes to how certain influencers benefit from black culture without truly respecting it. In a tense voicemail shared online, TJ vents about a conversation where he was told by an older figure that he seemed to be using drugs, like perks, because of his appearance. TJ strongly rejects this stereotype, stressing that he doesn't use drugs, but rather, he feels misunderstood and targeted because of his race. His frustration builds as he addresses the way people view him, highlighting that his success or struggles are often seen through a distorted, racist lens. TJ then shifts to his criticisms of Ross, accusing him of grinding his way to the top by exploiting black culture. TJ's point is that influencers like Ross often use the platform of black artists, like Kodak Black, without ever giving back to the culture.